Hello guys, Fagcast here, back with more or less play Final Fantasy 12. This is episode 48 now, yep. Uh, in the last episode, we made it through the Dracor Laboratory all the way to the 70th floor. And then we met up with a guy that tried to kill Bosch, then ran off up these stairs. So, well, let's see what's all the way up here. Dr. Sid. Sid? You know they affected Nethocyte brought down the Leviathan. How can you persist in this folly? <laughs> and you've come here to stop me. I'd fain see you try. Consider your bones, old man. You're outmatched. Pirates, scum of the skies. What brings you here? Treasure. What else would a pirate want? We'll take the Dusk Shard. <laughs> You've come all this way for that trinket. I thought you were above this. Hmm? What's that? Uh... The Princess of Dalmasca come to visit. Hmm? She's not entirely without merit. A test of sorts for our princess? Hmm. You're a babbling fool. A trial for a Shellia Banargan Dalmasca! You lust for the stone's power, do you not? <sighs> Lend him not your ears, my lady. He means to use you. <laughs> All right, let's do this. <clears throat> Manufactured nephrocyte, like Bergen. How could you do this? How could you fall this far? Very careful. All right, so what you want to do is do not attack Doctor Said. You want to attack all these rooks. But what we will do is, while well, there, do haste. Alright, while there, does haste there. Have him cast haste on Bosch. And then have him cast. Time magic, east on bottom. Alright, now that we all have. I believe we all have haste on us. Yep. Alright, one rook down. Always hiding behind your toys. Pity if anything were to happen to them. Alright, so right now, until we destroy all of these, we won't be able to do uh, much to Dr. Sid. So. Uh, oh, what's funny? It's not doing anything. Um, he himself. All right, yet another one down. Another thing you can do here, if you really feel like it, is um, uh, do a quickening chain on these and get a uh, concurrence going. And if you can pull that off. Then you'll be in much better shape. And then it'll just hopefully kill off all the rooks. Um, 
Make sure they all have haste, okay. Hi, Kyrga. Kyrga. This fight honestly isn't that hard, so. Why are we attacking Dr. Sin, not the Rook? They all stop. Oh, he straight out. <clears throat> and same with Vaughn. So, haste on Vaughn. Yeah, here we go. Stop attacking Dr. Sid. Alright, use rays. You can afford to do haste on yourself. Alright, now that the final Rook is down, Kyrga, and Kyrga. Alright, let's take down Dr. Sid. He has about eh, 73,000 HP. Oh, uh, what is he doing? Oh, son of a gun. That's not gonna be good. Uh, oh, that didn't do much. Make sure they all saw pace. Yeah, I'm not even going to use quickens on this guy. Actually, yeah, let's just speed it up and do it. Honestly, even with how uh, badly equipped our people are, um, Dr. Sid really isn't that hard. Um, and then... I don't even know. Twos now we just need to get level ones and threes. I never Alright, we get one more level three and we can do Arc Blast.
Oh, so many little tubes. Oh, we got 10 hits on that, should be enough to kill him. Plus, ooh, wind burst. Yeah, that's definitely enough to kill him. 25,000 damage. So that guy's name is Vinat. This creature. So this is your Vina. Oh, uh, never mind. A Shelia Benagin Dalmaska. Just how far will you go for power? Does your lust for Nethersite consume you? <laughs> am I right? I am, aren't I? A worthy daughter of the Dynast King. You would do well to go to Giruvagan. Who knows? You may receive a new stone for your trouble. Your words mean nothing to me! The reins of history back in the hands of man. I do make for Giruvagan. Give chase if you dare it. So Sid gets away. Hate it when he does that. Mayhaps you think me remiss, the Lady Ash of Dalmasca. The Sky Pirate Rethos, at your employ. Oh, so his name is Redis. The Imperial Senate, powerless to resist House Solidor's brutal purge, was dissolved. Vain Solidor reigned supreme over the Empire. Though this upheaval shook the Imperial Bastion to its foundation, these developments were, to say the least, welcomed by her military. The authoritarian rule of the judges, in tandem with the impending threat of Rosarian invasion, Served to foster camaraderie among its ranks. For our part, the resistance mustered strength in the border skies, making ready for the task ahead. A war to decide the doom of Ivalice would soon be upon us. Flame Tongue and Ogonex are away. All ships reporting in. They're breaking to begin ship to ship maneuvers against us. All hands, full ahead flank. We shall make ready to repel their attacks. Counter air. Track them as though they were the enemy. Counter air, to your stations. 
A dispatch from Naldoa Command, Excellency. The Sky Pirate has left Arcadian airspace. He makes for Balfonheim with the Lady Ash and her party. It is good to know the Lady still lives. But what of our bid for the stone? With the stone or without, our resistance should prove an even match for the Imperial Army. These weeks of training have honed our edge. I pray it is sharp enough. They choose to supply the resistance, yet raise not a sword in aid. What city could do this? A city of men without countries, pirates of the sea and of the sky. Few are they who would fain lay down their lives for a friend, let alone a king. The Marquis, he is set on war? The time approaches when he must make his position vis-a-vis -vis the Empire clear. When he helped you up the Leviathan, he spited the judges full sore. He cannot sit in idleness and expect to avoid a reckoning. The Marquis shares my distaste for war. Yet, if it comes to it, he will show no quarter. For the time being, we will continue to train the Resistance Army. Enough power on our side, and even Vane may see the appeal of the Treaty Table. Yet Vane holds the Nethysite. What makes you think he would treat when he holds such power? Power enough to sink the Leviathan. All the more reason for me to support your infiltration of the capital. You said it yourself. The Nethysite is a powerful weapon. I would have you acquire it for me. I have not said I would give you the Midlight Shard. If there is no stone, I would have to look elsewhere for aid. Then you would ally with Rosaria. As I must. Failure's not an option. It's just what Vane wants. He lures the Rosarians and the Resistance to the field, then crushes both with the Nethysite. I think not. Sid has a stone. We grab it and smash it to pieces with the Sword of Kings. Vane will be left holding nary a thing. Time is short. We follow Sid. He's heading towards Giru Vagan. Giru Vagan. It is told of in a song of my people. On the farthest shores of the river of time, shrouded deep in the roiling mist, the holy land sleeps. Giru Vagan. Who knows the paths, the way to its doors? Then you seek the Yok de Four. Deep within the jungle of Golmore, there is a corner of the Feywood where a mist storm surges and seethes. And that's it. Let's go. Right. <gasps> Not coming, Rivers? Forget your precious nether sight already? Sid's words rang hollow to me. I will follow another course. Ah, another lead then, is it? You're well informed. I could well say the same to you, pirate. Hurry it up, or we'll leave without you. Ah, Vaughn. I've had some of my men check on this Feywood. Best ask what they've found. Okay. Thanks for the help, brothers. <laughs> Fly first, ask questions later. Your apprentice is more pirate than you. I don't have an apprentice. Princess Ash, I would hear your heart. If Dr. Sid has spoke the truth, you may well be rewarded with more Nethysite in Giruvagan. Tell me, do you still desire the stone? I desire its power. I want, yet I also fear. I must protect Elmasca. I can't afford to fear anything. Do not forget Nabodis. That is my only counsel for you.
Ah, huh, I'll guess. If you finish talking with Lord Res, I suppose you'll be wanting to hear about the Feywood. Reckon we must be these people, they only... Yeah, they seek only to further their own ends and care little for our Lord, Lord's wants, if at all. These people? I see only a boy, and it's by Lord Redis' command. If you have concerns, I've got me a nose for ill intent. I'll take the measure of him. Or, I... not the pet at all. He measures up quite nicely. This one means no harm to Lord Redis. Measure? You barely measure up to his waist and that's counting the parrot. Oh, burn. Your con concerns duly noted. I, for one, plan on following Lord Russ's orders. Do as you please, but know that no good will come of this. I apologize, pay no mind. Now, where was I? Ah, yes. South of the vast Gomer jungle in... Kirwan, there lies a place known as the Feywood. The mist there is far denser than most, and even should you make it through that, there's no guarantee you'll make it past what lies beyond. Aye, he speaks of the hidden trial of the Feywood, which must be passed to open the gate to the holy city of Guru Vagan. Alright, so basically, we are in Balfinaheim Park now. Dr. Sid has run off to the city of Guru Vagan. And we must pass through the Feywood in order to make it there. Um, what else? Um, I think that's about it. Hmm. Uh, we are at like 24 minutes, but I'll explore the city a little bit before. See what new stuff we have. Got a Technic shop here. Do do do. Go to auto. See what we have to sell. Nothing. When we have to buy, we can buy, expose, and revive. Wonder what's at the weapon shop. Alright, Baruni will sell us the weapons. Oh. Now that we buy a new sword, he sells us diamond sword. New bow as well. And... That's about it. Just new sword and new bow. Then Emma, I believe, sells the armor. Yep. Yeah, that's going to help us out quite a bit. Hmm. Yeah, so I believe between this episode and the next one, I will go through and try to save up for all this new stuff that we can buy now. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Um,
Got more game. Actually, let's buy up some gambit since we're here. Ooh, there's a lot. See if I can afford all of them. Uh, da, 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 da. Oh my god, the dog needs to shut up. Oh my god, I swear to mm. This dog's gonna piss me off. Oh my god, there's so many new techniques. Or gambits, I mean, ah. And seriously, dogs seem to shut up. And more, and more. Oh my god. Alright, get in there. And that's all the gimmicks. Huh. Wonder what that means. Oh, we're still missing some. Not very many, though. Just like, okay, we're missing a lot. Never mind. Also, get some new magics here. Bargoth and the uh, Kiraja. Kiraja, I mean. Which is going to be really, really helpful later on for us. Uh. Alright, let's hurry up and go through here so that I can save and end the episode. Because it's already almost half an hour. Um. Got a new cartographer skill, Kirby's. Stuff in Balfon Hunter. So yeah, pretty much um by beyond this point here is the Kirobi step. But we will not be heading there just yet, so what I'll do is I will go ahead and save the game here. And I will see you guys in the next episode of Let's Play Final Fantasy XII. See you guys later.